Shamima Begum, the teenager who fled London to join the Islamic State group four years ago, won't be able to return home. The decision to strip her of her British citizenship came after Begum gave birth to her third child this weekend and called on authorities to show compassion by allowing her to raise the baby in the UK. I think a lot of people should have like sympathy towards me for everything I've been through, you know, and I, 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 I didn't know what I was getting into when I left and I just was hoping that maybe for, me, for the sake of me and my child they, they let me come back. Yet Begum didn't show any remorse, and her appeal didn't convince British authorities, which consider her a security threat. The UK's Home Office, which is forbidden from rendering people stateless, based its decision to remove Begum's nationality on the 19-year-old's Bangladeshi heritage, which could allow her to claim citizenship there. The move was hailed by Conservative MPs, who had been calling on the government to make an example of would-be returning jihadists. It's the right decision because we have to show two things. One, that we want to have a deterrence to stop people ever going to join uh, extreme Islamist terrorist groups. And secondly, that we will not tolerate under any circumstances um, people joining those uh, um, death cults. And if they do, there will be consequences. Begum's lawyer said her family was disappointed by the decision and that it would consider all available legal avenues. It now has a month to file an appeal.